here's a pretty nice looking specimen. I spotted this from up on the trail. Let's see what it looks like on the underside. It's pretty good looking. Uh, as these start to age, the pore surface starts to turn yellow and, or even green when they get really old and it starts to get not quite as good to eat. And they generally um, get eaten up by other animals such as uh, mad, like insects or worms or stuff like that. So I'm going to cut into the bottom portion of this and see how the stem is. It looks like there might have been some worm action up in the cap, but that cap isn't going to be that great to eat anyway. So let's see what it looks like. So generally when I find mushrooms in the field, I will cut off the dirt section um, so it's easier to clean them when at, at home. And as you do this, you can see whether the flesh is good to eat and you can see that there's been nothing in here really eating it. And the part that I've cut so far, see what we're working with here. Let's cut off the dirty part. Nice. So you can see that the flesh is mostly good. There's a couple spots, like one little worm spot there, little there. You can just cut that off when you get it home. And that's pretty, that's kind of surprising for a mushroom this size because generally they get pretty chewed up when they start to get bigger and older. This thing is probably like a pound. So I'm pretty excited. Um, it's getting pretty late in the mushroom season, so um, a lot of the mushrooms are really gigantic or no longer good to eat. So I'm happy to find a couple more so I can have a couple more tasty dinners. I have a lot dried out, so I should have a supply of mushrooms all winter. Delicious.